as a content creator based here in nigeria i understand the struggle when it comes to creating content but you don't have the budget to buy some of the most expensive gear which you think would give you some of the best results the truth is gear is important but you know starting with what you have is also important i put that in quotes in this video i'm going to be sharing with you my top gear in terms of mics lights tripods and the rest under 10,000 naira that you can start off with right now you're asking who is this person how does she know let me tell you something i started creating content about 10 years ago i'm talking blogs from blogs to podcasts to youtube and the rest and now i'm here and i've had to go from using my infinix phone to now acquiring gear lights mics different types now having tested and tried so many types of gears over the years here are my top five under 10,000 naira that will get you amazing results so without further ado let's get straight into today's video now the first one i have for you is the boya microphone is the boya lapel mic i've had this for about two years plus now and it has not failed me this microphone costs less than ten thousand naira depending on where you get it from you can get it for as well as seven thousand naira you can get it as high as ten thousand or maybe thirteen thousand different vendors have different prices one of the reasons why i really really love this microphone is that it is super long it's about three to five feet i'm not too sure the exact measurements like for instance now i'm recording on my canon camera with my 50 mm lens and you know if you use the 50 mm lens you have to be really far from your camera to be able to get the blurry background and this mic is perfect for that you don't have to be so close if you have to be far not just even for content creators if you are a videographer this is perfect for you i'm actually going to be getting another one really soon and that is the one that has two microphones because we're going to be shooting a couple of shows um i'm talking about my production company we're going to be shooting a couple of shows really soon so i really really like this microphone and i recommend it even some of your top youtubers have recommended this talking about people like dima ome kelechi mbemna sean Cannell, and the likes so yeah this is the first thing i really really recommend so the next on my list is this tripod this is a phone tripod i've had a couple of tripods in the past i've had like the ones that you use for vlogging i've had the long ones i've had really flimsy ones i've had really solid ones if you don't know i own and run a production company so i've had to test a lot of gear over the years and this is the one that i would say i recommend or is by far my favorite now the reason why i really really like this one is as much as it's you know it looks really small in terms of being a phone tripod the feet extends to about three feet can you see it extends really long and you can also extend this one as well so it's like stretches really long so it like stretches really long and it is sturdy for a phone tripod i just removed the this thing so you can attach it like this and put your phone on it one other reason why i really like it is most times you know all those phone tripods that you buy that once you have your phone like this the tripod starts uh tilting this one doesn't tilt it stays in position and i like that the feet has this grid under it so it keeps it sturdy it doesn't move and shake and all of that so i really really recommend this uh tripod i've had it for a while now i actually got it for five thousand naira depending on the seller i always say depending on the seller now the next thing i recommend is the light we all know how important light is so this is a ring light we all know i think everybody has this at this point this is a 10 inch 26 centimeter ring light um why i'm recommending this one is if you're on a really tight budget you can get only this one for about eight thousand naira depending and it also comes with like a phone holder i don't have my phone holder right now so if you are someone that does like tiktok reels instagram lives and the rest you can easily use this one and i really like that it has the usb port you can plug this to your you know to your laptop you can plug this to your phone charger you can plug this to your power bank you can easily take this on the move it's really lightweight it's not heavy in any way i'm going to switch it on now so this is what it looks like on oh, let me switch off one of my one of my lights so i switched off one of my lights so this is what it looks like on when you have this with your phone you can see that it illuminates your face you can change the color it's, i don't know what this color is orange translucent that be transfluorescent and you know you can change the color you can increase or dim the oh, i switched it off so you can increase or reduce the light 
let me switch on my other light. So one thing I really really like is that it has a you know, USB port so you can plug this to your phone. I have a charger here so you can just easily put this like this and charge or switch it on. It doesn't charge, sorry, switch it on or you can connect it to your power bank if there's no lights. I did a video about two three years ago complaining about some of the struggles of a youtuber in nigeria and one of the things i mentioned was light none of my current light uses um, um batteries they all plug directly to the power source so if there's no light now it will die but like for something like this you can easily just connect it to your ring light and you know you're on the go one, not, one, not, one other thing that i like about it is that it's super 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 lightweight you can see i'm carrying it like really really lightweight and because it's led it's not quickly spoil. Now the light also comes with a stand. Um, I usually don't use the light stand, but it comes with a very sturdy light stand, and it's really long as well. It's the one that you can use. I use this one for your like for your normal 24 inches ring light. So this is what the stand is like. I've had this for a while, but I've not had any reason to use it, and I'm going to explain why in a bit. So the reason why I've not had any reason to use it is because I usually would just attach my ring light to my phone tripod this is what this looks like so i just roll with this i don't need to overdo anything really really simple and the equation works really well for me so next one is the reflector this is what it looks like this is the this is the uh this is the 32 inch reflector there are bigger ones but this one is actually a really small one i got this i think 2019 this cost about Less than 5,000, I already can't remember, but right now I'm sure the price has gone up. So like I said, I used to record when I didn't have this much lighting. So I would usually use my reflector to bounce off light. So when I had my ring light, in front, back then when I had my ring light in front of me, I'd have my reflector in front of me as well, like under my chin, so to bounce the light from the ring light back to my face. Ring light, and the reflector is really nice. Stars. Every reflector has three colors. So there's black, there's gold, there's the white, which and then there's silver there's white and there's silver so i really really like this i recommend that you have this even if you have like all the lighting you can ever dream of reflector is really nice because blue light is coming like this i, I forgot to use reflector to be but hey i recommend you get a reflector i have another lapel mic here it's a short lapel mic i'm connecting it to my phone so that as well i also recommend if you don't have you know ten thousand or eight thousand to buy a lapel mic you can get a small one this one you can get on Dreamia for about three to four thousand naira, five thousand naira, and you can get on AliExpress for like five hundred naira. If you are ready to wait out the shipping, you can get on AliExpress. Finally, I recommend you get a memory card. Um, of course, you want to have this if you record with your phone. Even if you are recording with your camera, like you need all the space you need. I recommend thirty-two gig being the minimum you ever buy in terms of memory cards. Don't buy anything smaller. So this one I bought a while back, maybe like 2019 or 2020, I really can't remember. Uh, this is a 64 gig memory card, it's actually a phone memory card. So you have your phone memory card and then you have your... This one goes into the camera. So my top 6 content creation equipment below 10,000 naira if you're on a tight budget. All of these are tested, all of these I've used, all of these I'm currently using. So it's not something that maybe I went to download on the internet to come and tell you, you know, these are things that I use, the things that I really like. Do me Amazon links in the description box below. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask. I'm here to answer all your questions. I know it's a content, I know we're currently experiencing content shifts. I'll explain all of that maybe in a separate video, but for now, take me as I am. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button, subscribe down below. Um, and I'll see you in my next video.